Did you know that you can quickly create digital signs with information already posted on Digital Village? Let me take a minute and show you how it works. We don't want just anyone creating digital signs, so it's only accessible on the primary admin menu shown here. First let's set up our devices. We already have a few set up for the restaurant and the elevators. There are also two monitors mounted in the main lobby. Since we already have our devices set up, let's dive right in and create our first sign. The first step is to add a new content stream which will include the various types of content we want to display. Let's name it Morning Stream and save it. Notice at the bottom of the dialog window, we have a schedule option. This allows us to determine when the stream can be displayed. For example, perhaps we want to schedule this stream to run every morning from 8 to 11 a.m. To keep things simple we won't set this up right now. Once we close the window we can work on what type of content we want to include in our stream. A content stream consists of layers. For example, I will add an image layer which will be a picture. Since this content stream is intended for the restaurant monitor, I will post a picture of the breakfast special. See that was easy. I can preview it right away by selecting either the landscape or portrait icon shown here. By default it shows that slide for 5 seconds. Let's change it to 10 seconds by going into the set timings area. Next, let's add our breakfast menu. I can add it as a picture, but what would be better is if we can pick and choose from a catalog of menu items. To do this I will add a layer called resource. This allows me to search the catalogs for content. Let's use the keyword dining in our search. Once you find the menu you want to use, there is a copy and a feed option. Use copy if you want to change prices and menu item details. We won't be changing the information so let's use the feed option. Close the window and there is our menu. Out of the box it gives me all the menu items in our catalog but maybe I want to turn some off. To do this I will edit this layer. While I am at it, I might as well hide the headers. This will give me a clean display and show only the menu items. Next I will turn on selections. This adds a new selections option at the bottom. Now I can check off all the menu items I want to include and close the window when I am done. Okay, it looks good. Let's look at our timings again. Since we want to keep this demo short, let's make them both 5 seconds. Let's preview and landscape this time. It looks great. Now I can add it to one or multiple devices and optionally I can schedule the times I want it to run.